for meatloaf. What have you here, sir? This is ham and asparagus stuffed inside my funky <laughs> chicken. So, just so it's a chicken a, meatloaf. It is a chicken mixed meatloaf that we did. I'm going to place this right here on the plate. That's wacky. And the cool part is my mom always said, you know, sometimes just take the good stuff and stick it on the inside. That's right. Hide the vegetables on the inside. Hey, let me tell you also, this has been an exciting product, but we're down to our final quantities. Yes. We are not able to get a reorder in this item, so we're looking to clear our inventory so that we can make room for new kitchen goodies coming in. So you lucky foodies are in a, a very good opportunity situation today because... For the first time ever, we're putting this pan on clearance pricing. Now, ordinarily on QVC, it was $17, and that was a killer good price. That's correct. But today, we're going to make it even more irresistible and offer it to you for $12 <laughs> and change. Come on. Wow. We had this on earlier today. I understand we had already taken orders, I think, for over $400 uh, earlier this morning. So this is a great opportunity for you to go ahead and pick yours up in the following colors. I have it in red. I have it in black. And finally, I have it in blue. And you're getting the lid portion, or what I should say, the piece that you need to create the cavity in the meat. But then you're also getting the metal meatloaf pan and this insert that allows fats and oils to drip away. We're going to check in with Chef Tony, who's going to show us how the pan works. Correct. And then we're going to cut into some more delicious meatloafs. And Absolutely. just so you know, you're getting 14 recipes included with the pan to get you started. I just want to show everybody what they get. They're going to get the meatloaf pan itself, which is all nonstick. You're going to get your raised grate, which I love about this because it lets all the greases and fats drip down underneath so your meatloaf's not cooking it. And the magic's right here in the cover. Now, I'm going to demonstrate that, but I want to show everybody just some beautiful foods. Now, this is my Greek aisle, and everything you see here today is in our recipe book. So inside is a spinach, olive and feta cheese stuffing and Yum. just take a look at how beautiful that is that is yummy yummy for the tummy and you have pork recipes chicken recipes turkey and two beef and what's recipes. the meat in this one this one happens to be a beef okay and then this one is our pork recipe i think you'll enjoy this and i want to show everybody how simple this is this is an enchilada with cheese that we placed on the inside no so, way a pork meatloaf with an enchilada on the <laughs> inside and then more enchilada sauce and cheese on top absolutely Yum. Simple stuff. Hello, Tuesday night dinner. You uh -huh. can do something fancy on a Tuesday night. This one, my, I got to give Mitch a little credit here. He went a little bit crazy. Mitch is our food stylist. One of them that works in our this, prep folks. kitchen. How about a crab cake stuffing? <laughs> <laughs> it's a crab. It's actually a little twist on it because it has rice on the inside. But it's a wow. crab cake stuffing done inside our, again, a chicken. And you can do it whatever kind of meat you like. Chef Mitch is kind of fancy, isn't he? Mitch, Mitch is the bomb. I mean, <laughs> this is one that we came up with, okay, in honor of my mom. Two manicottis, or as we say, managots in Brooklyn. So you put the managots put the inside, inside in the, inside, the beef meatloaf. Tomato sauce in there. And David, the coolest part is it's so easy to make. Let me bring this up and show everybody. Take your meat recipe, and I give you five in my book. Place it inside the pan. Now, then, once you press it to this in, then you're going to use the lid to create correct. the cavity. Is that right? Correct. You can see the divot that's here. So what you do is you place it on like this, and when you press, it makes the cavity for you so you know exactly where the opening is. This one's a cold cut pipe, so I'm going to take a stack of cold cuts, which I just trimmed down slightly. You place it on the inside, cover it with your second layer of meat, and then watch this, because it actually seals it. So there's my meat on top. We place it like here and then once I press and I that just, creates kind of a dome uh, correct a, a dome finish I'll show on top. that too it's a dome on the top side and it just locks everything down and also seals the side for you so we pop this in the oven and by the magic of TV we'll pull one out hey let me remind you you do get chef Tony's little mini cookbook with this and you got all those great recipes to get you started. There are meatloaf recipes in here as well as glaze recipes, and they're all inside this little ring-bound cookbook that comes with your pan. Now, I will tell you, we've never done this pan on clearance before, and what this means is we're down to our final quantities in this pan. We can't get a reorder on this particular one, so we're looking to clear our inventory. So we're taking a top-shelf item and bringing it to you at a rock-bottom price, and you are responding in big numbers. Already, we've taken orders for 3,000 for the day wow. in this show alone. Over 1,500 are already gone. I thank guess I you. misspoke earlier. It was more than that. Like 1,400 sold this morning. Yes, thank hey, let you. me tell you, we have it in red, we have it in black, and we have it in blue. So, blue is the most limited color. We are on fire on the phone lines. Everybody grab yours, but Chef is going to show you now why that little suspension tray inside with the holes in it is important. Take a look. This is the key right here. So I'm just going to take the excess and pour it out because normally that's what your meatloaf sits in and why people don't like meatloafs is they say it tastes oily and too fatty and it does. Look at what just came out of there. Well, and and let's, be, and let's be very clear. Meatloaf is like a sponge. That's correct. And if you put meatloaf in grease, it'll soak that grease right back up. But if the grease has a place to go and the meat is separated from it, it doesn't reabsorb it. You never drink what's in that measuring cup. 
But if you're leaving your meatloaf in the, in the fats and the oils, you might as well be because they're absorbing them again. Here's your opportunity to make sure that they're all taken care of. Now, chef, let's do a little tasting. Absolutely. I just want you to see those ingredients. And what's cool about this recipe, David, it's got salamis in it, which I know you love. I love. All those juices from the salami permeate into the meat, so you get that so flavor So is this a throughout. beef recipe? Yes, this is a beef recipe this we're going to do here. This is beef with the cheese and the salami. Uh-huh. I'm going to let you give that a taste yes, because sir. tasting is believing. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I got to go. <laughs> Hang on. That's all right. Almost Take your there. time. Almost there. Mmm. 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 And Jeff, I love the glaze on top too. Thank wow, you. Wow, this is so good. It really is. And what it's is simple. this? Oh, you know, we have to have something cheesy on your show. Uh -oh. We always have something cheesy for you. Let's take this out. Well, I'm cheesy. Why not? Right? <laughs> I don't think that's the now. truth. That's never going to It's okay fly. if I say it. All right, here we go. All right, go. let me take my knife, and I just got to show this to everybody because get your plate ready, David. Oh, boy. You know it. You know it. I love when I do this to you. <laughs> Macaroni and cheese stuff meatloaf. And ham inside like a ham type loaf. So it's got pork and ham loaf mixed together. Oh, no way. Oh, yeah. You can have so much fun with this. Whatever your style of cooking is, do that. And then take whatever you like to do on the inside that you would do as a side dish and just stuff oh, it inside man. and have everybody see. Look I'll at just this. let you taste that. It's pretty, pretty mm. cool. Mmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I love your look when you eat good Oh, my food. gosh. And Chef Tony, yes. the meat is pork. And ham loaf, it's so good. Thank you so much. Thank Ooh. you. I mean, the, the possibilities. Chef, that's crazy. Thank you. That is crazy. So good. I mean, mm. you turn meatloaf into a statement, and that's the coolest part. You don't have to be in a fancy restaurant to make that kind of statement. It's really simple to do. Let me tell you that for the day now, we have taken orders for 5,300. I have. Uh, already 4,000 ordered in this show, and I have another 1,800 people wow. who just jumped on the phone lines. Let me tell you again real quickly, this is the clearance price. We're down to our final quantities in this pan. We cannot get a reorder, so we are looking to clear our inventory so that we can make room for new goodies in the kitchen category. So you are such lucky foodies because you're in the right place at the right time. You don't want any of these to sell out because we won't see this particular configuration back. I've got it in red. Here it is in black. Here it is in blue. You're getting the metal loaf pan as well as the insert that allows the fats and oils to drip away. This is K39240. It will come with a cookbook. You will get 14 starter recipes. Now, five of those are meatloaves, and then the others are glazes and toppings. So you'll have all of those inside. Chef Tony gave you a little starter booklet of recipes, but just get creative. Use your own meatloaf recipe in here. You find one on the internet you love, improvise. And if you think something sounds good with that meatloaf recipe, stuff it inside. Why not? Absolutely. All right. We've got it all coming together for you, and we're very busy on our phone lines. Please use automated ordering. Go to QVC.com. 6,500 are gone now, and 2,000 people just jumped on the phone lines, and red is very popular. Now, let's see what's inside here, Chef. You ready? Let's open this up. This is one my kids absolutely love. You like pizza? Yes. Okay, so why can't we take a pizza and stuff it inside a meatloaf? What? So that's your pizza stuffing with pepperoni, and I actually use a little lasagna noodles because I want that pizza yes. or kind of like Italian feel. And is it feel. a beef meatloaf? It's a beef meatloaf, yes. With but pizza you, stuffing? Correct. Yum. Now, you can do it with the turkey, you can do it with chicken, you can do whatever your favorite meat is, you can do. You guys. Grab some of that stuffing on the inside. Unbelievable. Thank you. It's a okay. fun, fun product. Hold this, please. <laughs> Would you please? <laughs> happy dance, happy dance. It's a golden yes. spatula. Happy dance. Get that spatula. <laughs> I love it, David. Wow, that's crazy. Thank you so much. Mm. All right, one more quickie. I Real show quick, and then we got to wrap up. Absolutely. Mm. Mm. I just want to. I'm open sad this about up. that because I can sit here and eat this all day. This is this is in honor of my aunt. She really got me into the stuffing. Of this has egg inside and fresh ham and spinach. And and that's very traditional to do an egg and meatloaf. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. This is K three nine two four zero. Let me tell you real quickly. We have sold over eight thousand five hundred for the day in this show alone. 6,500 and 2,500 people are waiting on the phone lines to place an order. Red is getting limited. Please don't wait on the red. When this is gone, gone for good. Clearance pricing, first time, unbelievable price, $12 and change. And yes, you will get some starter recipes to get you going. But just use your favorite meatloaf recipe inside and stuff inside whatever you think pairs well with it, which is great. Chef, we're going to see you many more times today. Absolutely. Thank, Thank you. you, my friend. Let's check in with the lady in red. The fellows are crazy on the red carpet for the lady in red. <laughs> Miss Mary. You're cracking me up. I tell you what, after stuffed meatloaf, I'm glad I didn't see that before I had to put this dress on. It may not have happened. Let's get real.
but it's Golden Spatula Awards Day. Been talking about it for weeks on my Facebook page. 